Advanced Steel 2014 has a set of enhancements for the automatic creation of workshop and general erosion drawings. This movie demonstrates how the user can interact on the orientation of the views displayed on a workshop drawing. Let's take the example of the outside stringer of the stairs. With the show only the selected assembly icon, we can display only the stringer itself, with all the parts which are shop, bolted or welded to it. We can now move the UCS and rotate it to get the XY plane oriented as we want to get the view on the assembly drawing of the stringer. Advanced 2014 provides this new icon that we are now using to specify the main view orientation that we wish to get for the entire stringer. Once done, we can control that by selecting the stringer and choose Show Assembly CS from the contextual menu. We can see a temporary symbolic plane displayed at the end of the stringer to be sure this is how we want to represent it on the workshop drawing. To get the assembly drawing, we can go through the Quick Documents and choose one of the several available ready-to-use presentations. The drawing is then created automatically and the result can be seen in the document manager where you can check the result and see that the stringer has been oriented as expected. If you would like to get the same drawing but with a different orientation of the main view, it's easy to go back to the 3D model. Rotate the UCS as desired and then apply again the define assembly detailing orientation and pick the stringer so that it gets oriented like the current XY plane of the UCS in the model. Once again, it's easy to control if the defined plane is the one you expect to have. There is no need at all to delete and recreate the drawing. Advanced Steel offers the possibility to automatically update the existing drawing thanks to the document manager. Now you can see the result where the main view is oriented to display the slope parts horizontally for easier fabrication.